Is your Kindle not opening books anymore? Well, this issue is quite common among Kindle users and we just know what you need to do to get this fixed. Stick around till the end and check out all the fixes that I mentioned in this video and I'm sure that you will be able to find a fix that will work in your case. Your Kindle, if it's not connected to the internet, can only show you its downloaded books. If your book has not been downloaded, your Kindle won't be opening it. So, I recommend that you take a look at your network connection. First, ensure that your Kindle is not in airplane mode as it disconnects the device and refrains it from connecting to any other network, including any cellular plan that comes with your device. To disable the airplane mode on your Kindle, swipe down and open the Quick Actions tab. Then, tap on the airplane mode icon if it's lit to disable it. Now, if your device is connected to your Wi-Fi, it does not necessarily mean that it has access to the internet. Check your network for issues and the best way to do so is to connect to the same network using a different device like your phone. If your network seems sluggish on this device as well, consider power cycling your internet router. Simply unplug the router from its power source and plug it back in after a minute. Finally, if you're still facing issues, try connecting your Kindle to a different Wi-Fi network. To do so, open the Settings tab on your Kindle and select Wireless. Then, tap on Wi-Fi Networks. Choose a new Wi-Fi network and enter the login credentials to complete the setup. Another red flag that can trigger your Kindle to not open a book is the absence of an account sync. If you don't have account sync enabled on your Kindle, it can have a hard time opening books. This is especially evident if you purchase your books on a different device and don't have the book downloaded on your Kindle. Fortunately though, you can enable sync quite easily on your Kindle. All you need to do is swipe down and open the quick access menu and tap on the sync button. Wait for the Kindle to complete the sync and now try opening your books. Now, if you have a book downloaded on your Kindle and you're having trouble opening the book, you can always remove and re-add the book. All you need to do is tap and hold on the title that you want to delete from your Kindle library and select Remove from Device. Once done, reboot your Kindle by pressing and holding the power button until a pop-up box appears. Press the Restart button and wait for the Kindle to boot back up. Now, after ensuring that your device is connected to your Wi-Fi, go to the home page and tap on the library tab. Clear any filters set on top. Your whole Kindle library and purchases should appear. Tap on the book you want to download and you should be good to go once the download completes. Firmware updates are crucial for the optimum functioning of your Kindle devices. If your device is running an outdated firmware, issues are bound to crop up. And so, if you haven't checked or updated your Kindle, now might be the best time to do so. To update your Kindle, head over to the Quick Actions tab and select All Settings. Select Device Options and then tap on Advanced Settings. Now, tap on the Update your Kindle tile to check and update your device. This tile will be grayed out if you have no further pending updates. Once your device finishes with the update, try opening your books. As the last step in troubleshooting this issue on your Kindle, consider factory resetting your device. A factory reset will revert all of the system settings to their factory defaults and delete all books from your device, including any bugs that might have been the root cause of this issue. To factory reset your Kindle, open the settings menu of your Kindle and navigate to the device options. Tap on reset and confirm your selection to initiate the factory reset. Wait for the device to complete the reset and set it up from scratch. Enable sync and download all your books from your Kindle library. Now, try opening them. And with that, I believe that I've touched on everything that I wanted to talk about regarding fixing a Kindle that refuses to open a book. If you found this video useful, do comment your thoughts below, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Kindle content.